Hi comrades, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Last time we established that, uh, yeah, that, that this doesn't work. No, that, that, it's all very well building docks and what have you, but if there aren't ships to actually ride on them, there's precious little point. Anyway, that didn't stop me building like a lot of stuff last time. Hang on, I'm trying to zoom out to an exciting angle. Uh, yeah, we got a bit of this over here. No, I'll turn the interface back on. We got uh, we got one of those. Yeah, we got another one here. The idea was that a little boat would do that, right? And nothing else. That was it. That was that was the whole scheme. Doesn't work. Uh, and then uh, I've got one of these. Oh, and what's this one for? This is a, a little dock here as well. Yes, that's nice. What can we do? Buy a new vehicle. All right. Uh, nope. Uh, yep. And uh, oh, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Hang on. Hang on, something's changed. Did, either I didn't click on this last time round, or, uh, or ooh, ah, ooh, right, hold on. Yeah, no, I, uh, did I just not do this? Interesting. Okay, well, we've got this passenger ship, which is fine, 135 passengers, all right, okay, that's you, you can work with that. Uh, and then you've got this freight deliverer here that appears to deliver everything other than, uh, other than oil or fuel bit of a downer uh this one here will do everything in in a greater quantity than uh, than oil or fuel well maybe it's just a case of waiting then maybe maybe if i just bide my time uh this will resolve itself uh we then got this one here which is where i can build ships someone uh, well several of you said that you can actually then go on and sell them as uh, you well, well maybe uh but uh we'll see uh purchase resources Oh, you can buy stuff to actually build the ships with, but I haven't got any blueprints. Uh, blueprints would have to be developed somewhere. Everyone said technical college, uh, which is what I've got. I've got a technical university here. So maybe if we look at research, advanced engineering or chemistry. Nice. Let's have a look at advanced engineering. Oh, no, apparently that's just something I'm researching. All right, well, look, I'll tell you what. I'll leave that researching, and, and we'll see what's what eventually. It's nice, though, isn't it? Look, look at how many people are using the university. That's all good. Anyway, today, we we can't hang around. We've got to press on. And the plan is uh, to uh, to extend the rail line out over the uh, over the coast here. And, well, it's sort of, sort of coast. Over the coast here. And, uh, and make it as far as Baraharara. Now, the trip to Baraharara... Uh, is uh, is only part of the mission. I mean, eventually we're going to end up uh, down near uh, Baraslaw, I guess, right? Baraslov. Uh, or or smell, smell you later. Uh, no, no, smell you later is on our side of the border. No, it's not. It's the other connection there. So, yeah, this is our uh, our overall objective, uh, is to get to Baraslaw, uh, Baraslav, which I suspect is how you pronounce it. Um, but that's that's a long way off yet. But we can uh, we can get a bit more cash coming in in the short term by doing this initial hop. So that's what we'll do. We'll do the initial hop, and then uh, then later on we'll go a little bit further. So first job is uh, let's get a bridge up. Uh, this this should be relatively straightforward. Now this is going to cost a bit of a. It's going to cost a chunk of money, but everything costs a chunk of money. Well, we've got the railway bridge 121 or a steel deck truss for 135. Or the truss bridge. Uh, we, we'll go with railway bridge. And, uh, well, where's the where's the most efficient line to take this through? Not that efficiency is something I particularly care about. Uh, this is this is all about just build the sucker. Uh, so if I take that up to about, about there and then uh, wang it over like that. 184 grand. Now, I run a profitable enterprise. Apparently, we're doing that. No. Yes, yeah, 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 no, you had uh, you had Let's Build It already switched on. So that's a thing that's happening, and it's too low to get any ships under. So, uh, you know, you're probably going to need to rethink that later on. Okay, well, there you go. Ta-da, bridge. Okay, right, well, good. So, that wasn't exactly what I had in mind, but it's it's been done anyway, so uh, so everything's good. Was that electrified? You you make a you make a very valid case here. How does one electrify the bridge? Don't tell me this kind of bridge is not electrified. Well, yeah, well, okay. You, you're allowed to tell me as long as oh dear. All right. Let's assume for a moment it will inherit the electrification that is about to occur. 
because anything else is just madness at this point. All right, let's let's uh, let's carry on building anyway. And then uh, and then afterwards, we'll... Uh, let's turn auto build off for a moment. There's a there's a scheme. What's... What exactly is... Your, no. Look, I want to I I connect to the... There you go. Right. How about... How about a slightly less... Uh, abrupt uh, change, in, change in angle there. There you go. That's better. Right. Good. Just... Would you mind awfully... No, it won't go in there. No, I think you're going to struggle here, you know? Yeah. Uh, what else could I do? Well, you could grab a bit more of this. All right. If it will grab the lozenge and go out as far as here, but bring it down a bit. Well, hold on. Let's have a look at that. Is that I think that, because that might have brought it down a bit already. Sorry, the border is interfering with my camera movement. Uh, and that's, uh, you know, sorry, it's not making me happy. Um, yeah, okay, that's acceptable. And then uh, and then carry on, but this time we'll go with a bit of this. There we go. It's, why is it... Why? No, 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 look. I wanted you to... Oh, well, never mind. It's fine. Okay, how am I going to make this work with this junction? I mean, remodeling the junction again would probably be a, a, a reasonable way to go. Uh, we're only going to run one train up here for now. I'll tell you what, the right time to uh, to uh, to remodel this junction will be later on will it yeah it will be later on once we've actually got stuff uh no i think it's going to be now isn't it okay all right fine uh right let's get that built yeah you you well crikey come here just give me this yeah do that right okay right okay now let's uh let's pause up uh let's, let's grab the uh grab the bulldozer which I still can't remember. Is that there? there must be a hotkey for it, but whatever it is, I'm not using it right now. Right, get rid of all this. Yeah, that's it. Good. Right. Now, we want to leave as much of a swoop as possible for this piece of track here because uh, we've got we've we've got regular trains that need to queue in there, and we don't really want them overlapping the uh, overlapping the infrastructure. So we want to take this one out that way. Uh, and then wrapper it down to onto there, like so. Uh, you that, and then this all needs to merge cleverly. I mean, or it doesn't. It may not may not actually need to merge cleverly. Just a, a, a an appropriate set of points will probably do the trick. Now then, while I'm here, I'm gonna I'm gonna save myself some trouble later on. Do, do you want to do you want to get bulldozed there? Oh no, hold on, I'm not on the bulldozer. See, I, I, you can tell, and I've literally just been playing Train Fever because I'm uh, Transport Fever. Hasn't been called Train Fever for a while. Whatever, uh, because I've, I'm trying to just uh, hit B, and then I assume that it's worked, which it, it just hasn't. Now you could swoop around the outside of that uh, that substation, but I think just going up to there might do the trick. Basically, I want to give myself as much run as possible to do something like that. Now that's that's quite an ugly angle, but it will uh, it will get the job done. Uh, and then also we can then we can then put in a one of those like that, right? And then uh, signal, 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 and uh, and everything will be marvelous. Buy it. Okay, it's uh, it's ugly, but it'll do the job. Um, right. Okay. Now over the other side. Assuming this bridge has electricity, which, given that I'm not seeing any kind of a pantograph on there at all, nope. I mean, I, just just slap a bit of that in. That hasn't got any pantograph. Does, don't tell me that you can't... Uh, yeah, what about this one? Nope. Is it, is it not going to work? I, I have a strong suspicion that this is not going to work and that I'm going to need to set up a diesel unit to do this. Now, that that in itself is not necessarily a deal breaker. It's just a bit of a drag. Um, but, you know, we'll we'll see where we, uh, we, we'll see where we get to. Uh, right, okay, now, start thinking about how you're actually going to do this. I'm going to do it belligerently and in a straight line, more or less. Okay, all right, fine. You need a free excavator. Look, pay for it. I don't care. Auto build on. All right, here we go. All right, 
Yeah. Now then, after I've uh, after I've built this section, there is a very very strong likelihood uh, that I'm going to need to uh, wait for the money to recharge. The good news is I'm making money, so uh, it's it's only a matter of you know set the game on a high speed and uh, and give it enough time to, to to catch up on things. There you go. Yeah, keep it going. Uh, right. How far? Much further? No, it's not far at all. Uh, and then as we move down this way, hopefully this uh, this line that we're building here can end up being a uh, uh, an overall kind of connection to uh, to a couple of other towns that we build uh, as we head down towards the uh, the border with the west, um, and uh, and that we get some more some more goods out of it as well. There's certainly plenty of room to be doing more uh, what do we call it more more booze. We can certainly make more booze. That's you know that's a thing that we can do. Uh, also, just want to note, and, and you knew this last time, there isn't actually a station here. There's no train connection. What about Molno, which is the next one down? It's a long way. Yeah, it is a long way. It is a long way. Uh, and that leads me to go, well, uh, do we think the train is going to have enough juice in it to take it that kind of distance? Also, how much is this going to cost? And well, hold on. It's let's uh, let's do that, and then we'll see how much we have got left. All right. Well, you know that's that's a bit of money gone. <laughs> it is a bit of money gone. Uh, you're not uh, you're not wrong. Okay. Well, well, we'll just go with Plan B, and we'll put a, a little unload station uh, kind of deal, kind of thing, kind of thing in here, and uh, that's going to need electricity, which is going to be more expense. Keep going. All right. Okay. I didn't want to take electricity around here. I don't, we're gonna have to. You're gonna have to tunnel through that. Uh, okay. Build railway tunnel. Actually, you didn't need to electrify the tunnel. The tunnel did inherit uh, the uh, the the state of play there. As far as what's the problem? What's your what's your issue? Maybe I'll start the tunnel too soon. Right. Hey, 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 that worked. That's 161 grand. You haven't got much money left. Yeah, I know, but the the plan is after I've after I've done this is uh, is we'll let it run for a bit. I mean, it might end up being 1970 by the time we pick the action back up again, but we will be able to pick the action back up again with some cash in the bank. You're going to have to tunnel through that as well. You're not going to make it. Oh, Ruddy Nora. Well, Ruddy Nora, notwithstanding, uh, this is. The, everything you're doing here is contingent on you being able to actually sell something out the other end. Also, feel I should mention that uh, you are going to have to buy a train. Uh, yeah, quite. Okay, all right. Well, we're down to seven hundred grand. How much do we think it's going to cost us? Well, it, if you if this tunnel is efficient. Which would be a first, uh, but if if this uh, was an efficient tunnel, I don't know. Talk to me. Okay, go on, go on. We can get out of it. It's above the terrain at some stage. All right. Okay. So you you want me to what exactly? Oh boy. Okay. Yeah. No. This is this is going to empty my bank account. The the good news is that none of this is actually wasted because it's it's all leading us down towards the border which is where we want to get to eventually, to start getting some, some bucks funneled in. Um, then the only reason I'm, I want to funnel any buck... There you go. What's that? That's another 270 grand. Well, no, look. I'm all in at this point. We're, we're, we're following the sunk cost fallacy. And, uh, and we're going to pursue this regardless of the outcome. If we end up running out of dosh in the short term, then we end up running out of dosh in the short term. And then later on, we'll have more dosh available. Just keep going till it tells you you have to stop. I don't think the whole of civilization is going to fall apart. I think it will keep going, even though you have absolutely caned uh, your your bank balance. That's a that's a bold assertion. Uh, right, how far how far have we got to go? That that's another flipping mountain range. Yeah, keep going. There you go. Right. Do you want to actually let your, your bank balance settle now, uh, now that you've built that? Because that's the other thing, is it doesn't deduct the cash from you in one hit. No, it, uh, it, it deducts it over time, which is quite nice. But at the same time, it means that you can end up having spent everything 
and uh, and still be waiting afterwards for uh, for the action. Um, hello, what's going on here? Are you doing this because you're still building? I know tunnels take a little bit longer to build. Uh, let's go check the previous tunnel and see if we've got the same story. No, the previous tunnel's done. That's good. Bit of a bit of a weird angle going on there. Cash is still going down, and I've got one more tunnel to build. We have at least got the junction. I tell you what, no, don't just do the junction. Put the signals in as well before you're out of cash. Uh, otherwise, you'll be, you know, you'll be sad. Yep. Okay. You've got a signal there at least. Yeah, but you see, look, he's still having to wait because it's treating this as being on the same block. Flipping block signals. Uh, right, sling that there. And then uh, go again that way. Is that right? Hold on. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Rubbish camera use on my part there. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, stick the one here. There you go, like that. Anything else? Uh, we'll stick one here. Yeah, like that. Right, okay. And then we'll stick a release signal on this one. So that they've entered another block and everything is groovy. That should be enough. Hold on, you're lost. What's the problem? It's relatively easy, isn't it? I haven't asked you to do something un unreasonable. Where are you trying to get to? And what have I not done that I should have done? There is the potential that I need a slip... Yeah, you need a slip junction here. You can't get onto the right side of the track. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. You don't need to tell it it's a slip junction. It just does it automatically if it can. Oh, bum. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's your... That's your runway busted there. Unless you can turn that one into a diamond. Well, we'll we'll see. Here we go. Grab from there to there. That should do it. There you go. Right, good. Fine, 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 fine. Right, good. Yeah, signals all good. Signals all good. Okay, what have we got left? Two eighty-five and dropping. What am I spending on at the moment? I wonder. What am I spending on at the moment? I'm, all, I'm obviously spending on something. Uh, what would it be? Shouldn't be fuel. I'm, I'm distributing fuel to, to fuel stations. Mo most likely, it's going to be I'm buying oil. Yeah, I'm buying flipping oil. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah. Now, it, you should have stopped working if you can't output. We shouldn't be buying any more oil. Now, the reason that I'm buying oil is because I don't want to... Uh, I, don't, I don't want to hang around and wait. Well, but then, you know, the, the flipping tank's full. What have we got here? Bitumen. Oh. Are we buying it and processing it, but yet nothing's occurring? If I were to tell this to pack it in... Empty hole storage, no. Uh, discard, no. Uh, it's going to be the purchase. Purchase resources, don't. All right, money's going back up again. Now, that, that tick up we've got going on there, I don't think there was a train hit the border recently. That tick up is going to be... Let's have a look. Oh, no, that was a train hitting the border. Uh, but we're also selling electricity over the border as well. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, hello. Oh. Well, here's a turnip for the books. Why have you done that? It's because you've got signals here. Oh, well... Jack, that's just brilliant, that is. Yeah, if you were to ch change those signals to be one way, then that will work again. Not by one way, I mean I mean single direction, right? That would keep that as a red light. Okay, you're going to have to turn this train around. Alright, turn around. Go away. Oh, you're going to be stuck, aren't you? Because you can't get over the other side of the track. Alright, hang on. Hang on, I'll fix that for you. That's all right. That's okay. This is all part of the service. Uh, just, just fling that on there. Now that's going to create another flipping block that's going to cause me no end of drama as well. Right, turn around. Go on. Uh, how about going to, go to Dallas, send it to that stop. Turn around. Go to Dallas. Go to Dallas. Go to. All right, bulldozer. Very few things in life 
cannot be removed or dealt with through judicious application of the bulldozer. Can't delete this piece of infrastructure. I'm not, I don't want the infrastructure, I want that. Well, you're going to need a more delicate removal tool. Yeah, all right. Well, point me at it then. I'm on the I'm on the right bit. Where are you? Cancel semaphore. There you go. Right. You come here. Turn around. Go there. Go. Right. Let this unclog. And uh, and then you know we'll be back in business again in a moment. Yeah, you could try it there, sunshine, but I'm not allowing it. Okay. Oh, where are you going now? I know you know you're blocking that because there's no there's no signal on there for ages. Uh, so if we uh, if we slap a quick uh, a quick semaphore in here, in fact you should be able to get as far as there. No, it's because it's a block signal and therefore the fact that you've got a train behind you is currently meaning that you can't move forwards because block signals are a brilliant way to do anything at all. Oh, cheeky. Uh, right, so if you stick one there. Can't place a semaphore here. Well, I'll, I'll place one there then. Right, and like that. Okay, good. Yeah, right, there we are. It's all working again. Now, I mean, you know, we we fluffed a fair bit there because, uh, you know, just to keep it moving. I know it all needs redeveloping and doing better and so forth, but uh, but it works for the most part as long as everybody doesn't all arrive at the same time. It's like when three of you try and you nick the same car parking space in the supermarket. It's just not going to work. Uh, no, you, you, you're going to have to wait until one goes after the next, after the next, and so forth. So it's only because both trains were arriving at the same time that there was a problem. And obviously that problem only manifested because my signals were rubbish. Uh, so uh, there's that. It's, this bridge does not look entirely safe. It's not stopping people using it, and it is quite picturesque, but it's, uh, it's problematic nonetheless. I, I, what are you? What's your problem? Hello. What do you want? What's the issue? Uh, yeah. Right. Go. Go back to the warehouse. Go on. View, uh, view area where a possible issue exists. What? Well, it, that's not an issue. This is going to be the issue. You're, you want to go up there because you're the, uh, you're the booze train, right? I've finished the booze train. This is all still electrified. You're going to come up here and slope over that way. Uh, why? Yeah. Maybe it's because I've only got a, a one-way semaphore on there. I didn't think they actually affected uh, direction, but uh, we'll uh, we'll make you two-way again, and maybe that'll cheer you up. It's cheered it up, look. All right, good. Which means you're going to have to go back to the refinery and make that signal two-way again. But you can't put two-way signals on a one-way bit of track. Well, that's that sounds very much like a you problem. Well, it's not. It's not just a me problem. That's an all of us problem. All right, all right. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to rethink of that. Oh no, no. You you, you use chain signals, baby. Oh yeah. Oh, interesting. So, what if I were to? Because uh, uh, you know, train signals never use it. So uh, let's uh, let's let's get rid of that. All right. All right. Turn that into a chain signal. How does it know what it's chained to? Uh, well, no. It it, it just knows. It will stay red if the next signal is also red. Oh, okay. Yeah. No, that's that's my understanding of them anyway. Well, we'll see what it does when the next train comes up. And there should be one uh, heading back in soonish. Anyway, as you can see, the money is going up, right? And it's going up quite healthily. So uh, so that's all good. I mean, it's it's probably going up more healthily now that I've told this to stop buying more oil. Which, you know, that's a, that's a sensible move. Uh, it was purely because if you've got 400-odd workers in your workforce there, it, uh, it surely makes sense to keep them working as much as possible, especially when the, uh, the whatever it is you're outputting is generating a good chunk of change. Um, but uh, but that's, that's fine. That's fine. Right, okay, so what we're going to do is uh, to, to build up my own education of everything in the world... What happens to this, that's now green, when this train that's coming up here is in there? Right, 
So it should, if this was a normal signal, it would go green. And it hasn't. It's gone blue. What does it even mean? Well, it means that it's it's recognised that the path is ex is uh, is unavailable. All right. Okay. Yeah. Intriguing. I do like the trains in this, though. Oh, hold on. Why are you stuck? Have we not just created the same problem again, but we just moved it down straight? Why are you blocked? You. Yes. Yeah, I'm talking to, uh, because of the escape route. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, just block signals do my flipping head in. Because uh, that makes no sense at all. Except it does make sense. Can't place some for here. Well, that's incredibly unhelpful. Um, I'll tell you what I could do. What? Well, I just, just kill it. Go on, kill it. Kill it. I mean, you you don't seem to be doing anything there, bulldozer. Where, where's the track knacker? There you go. Knacker the track there. Nope, doesn't work. Oh, you're job, 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 job. Okay, no, that's fine. No, 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 no. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll work our way through it. Yeah, yeah, we'll work our way. Not even that, right? There is no possible way for this train to be on that set of track at the moment, is there? Is there? No, there isn't. Therefore, these signals are stupid. Uh, don't get me wrong, I've used them wrong. That's fine. I freely admit to that. But it's still stupid. Uh, come here. I can't place something for here. Look, I need. I only need to get my derriere out of this bit. No, you don't. Oh, I don't, do I? All right, hold on. No, we can move this forwards. Move forwards. It's still going to be blocking that pigging junction. Alright, okay. Okay, that's alright. Uh, yeah, you just have to be able to kill that pigging junction and then everything will be uh, returned to righteousness. Alright, alright. Oh, wow, that's... That's done something. Right, uh, okay, get rid of that. Yeah, get rid of that. Don't care. Right. No, worth it. Right, go. You can go now. There we are. Right, sorted. Right, you pass through there. That opens up. You can now go. Uh, so if we put another one here, uh, like that, then that will, that will make that happen a little bit quicker. Uh. I need to redevelop this junction to make it work. Yeah. Also, we're also, almost up to 400k now, so that's that's good too. How are we? How are you doing here, team? We've got oil again. Good. That's good. Right. What do you got in there? 600 odd. And in here, you've got negligible, but we're still, for some reason, hanging on to it in the refinery. Uh, but that's okay because it means that anything new that we make is going straight through into the bitumen tank. So that's that's all fine. Right, okay, back to the front lines. Now, given that those tunnels have said yes siree, Bob, in terms of, uh, of, uh, of having electricity, uh, then one can assume, or one is going to assume, rightly or wrongly, uh, that... Uh, no, back up, this one. Um, that, uh, that, that what? Uh, I don't know, lost my train of thought. Uh, the, the, the bridge will do the same thing. There you go. That's it. Uh, no. No, I don't think this is going to work, you know. I think you're going to have to come up the mountainside a little bit uh, and then uh, and then adopt either an over-the-top kind of an approach. All right, well, let's see what it does. Flat the terrain. Yeah, you can have that bit. Now, hopefully we'll be able to wind it back down the other side again. Either way, it means we haven't got to buy a flipping tunnel here and uh, tunnels are, uh, are wondrously expensive. Or is that reassuringly expensive? Well, whatever it is, they are. Yeah, okay. Now, maybe tunnel this last section. Yeah, right, okay, as far as that. Okay, gonna make it. I don't think I'm gonna be able to afford a train, but I am gonna be able to afford the track. Uh, that's okay, we've only got to wait for a little while to have the money to be able to get the train. Uh, flatten. Yep. 
Yeah. Look, I have been holding the right button button to flatten. All you've got to do is then deliver on that. Hold the right button to flatten. Hold the right button. I am doing. All right, I'll flatten that bit as well. I'll flatten as many bits as you want. Now, I'm happy for this just, just to go direct for now because that's all I needed to do. <laughs> Later on, we'll uh, we'll build a slightly more complicated or, uh, or sophisticated uh, junction there as sophisticated as these junctions get. Now, that's traveling a good distance. You don't get any benefit by, uh, by traveling further. But because there is a, uh, a surplus of, uh, of fuel, particularly, uh, coming out of the, the Tantrum refinery, it made sense to me just to whip it down the line and, uh, and have an occasional extra surge of dosh coming in. Uh, that will also use up some of the extra fuel that's being uh, created. Yeah. Okay. This all seems to be this all seems to be working here. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's have a let's have a word with it and uh, and see what it's going to run me to uh, to get another train in motion. Uh, we're over here. Right. So new vehicle or mechanism. Oh, we want electric loco. Now we've had a couple of new ones come in since I last uh, I last fiddled with this. We want something with plenty of grunt. Actually, I'm, I'm probably quite happy to use the VL23 again. We've used quite a few VL23s, or have we been using the VL10? I think we've been using the 10 rather than the 23. I can't remember. Uh, either way, 240k gets me 110 kilometers an hour. It's 160. Yes. Engine power, 5,100. 6,400. I mean, it really depends on the length of the train that we're going to run. Actually, not a hugely lengthy one. So that's 172. And then for the wagons to go on that, max speed 30. Yeah. Really? Yes. Max speed 30. And that can't be true. I've, I'm already I'm running several that, that go faster than that. Hold on. Here's one now. What speed are you doing at the moment there, Gov? 74. All right. Can I view your consist from here? No, I can't. Do we think max speed 30 is a load of old rubbish then? Well, well, I, I imagine so. Cargo wagon. Motor wagon. No, 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 no. We don't want a motor wagon. Uh, I'm, not missing a, I'm not missing another cargo job. No, I think the 30 is a big nonsense. Okay, so these are 20 grand a pop. So five of them... Uh, which would be what 300 tons of uh, of fuel yeah it doesn't really make it worthwhile yeah but that's 100k which means i've got 250k to get a loco with and then if it if it ends up doing quite nice if you're fat let's do it uh right the electric loco i'm gonna go for send your speedy here see how it gets on now i realize that's probably a passenger wagon but uh i don't care Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, I'll take as many as it will it will let me before my cash runs out. Okay, cool. Uh, right, let's get you in motion there, Tiger. Um, I'm going to need another signal in there, but the money's the money's going to be appropriate for that. Uh, right, you talk to me. Okay, right. Step one. Uh, step one is to go into the pickup station, which is this one yeah load 100 percent of anything uh, uh let's just go fuel because we're not producing bitumen at the same uh, at the same velocity wait till you're fully loaded we've got a new wagon available oh that's nice i tell you if these wagons only do 30 then uh, uh then we'll be we'll be heading back to the depot pretty pretty much post haste uh, to uh, to replace them with something else Although, I have no idea what. And then, we've got a Molner where we shall uh, wait until unloaded. Unload, wait until unloaded. There you go. Flogged a lot. Uh, off you go. First stop is unreachable. Well, tell you what. Go to the next stop. Start. First stop is unreachable. I, I don't need you to go to the first stop. Go to this one. Uh, just, uh, just go. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, do it the other way around. I like your thinking. Can I drag these? No. All right. Cancel that then. Uh, we'll uh, we'll just add another stop afterwards. It's fine. If you're if, if you're going to fight me through uh, through your your own sense of logic, yeah, I, it means we're doing a dry run first. 
uh, literally, literally a dry run, uh, and then add a new stop. This one. All right, and then uh, oh, that's not a, no. This one, yeah. Load, weight, fuel. Have it. First stop is unreachable. I think it might be saying that, yeah, because it needs electricity on the bridge. Please hold. All right, can you get over there? No, that signal. Okay, right. <coughs> okay, no, that's fine. No, that's fine. No, 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 because no, you have to have the signal doing that to allow traffic to travel two ways on it. That's a, that's a thing. Okay. Good. How much have we got in the bank? We've got 30 grand in the bank. That's going to go up, though. There we go. Have some booze. Yep. Uh, right. We're up. I'm lost because the camera moves really quickly. Right. Okay. Let's try that again. Hello. Go. What do you know? It worked. Right. Let's, uh, let's slow it down and zoom on in. Now then, there much remains to be seen here about whether or not this is going to, uh, this is going to pan out. Uh, follow the vehicle right on board. There you go. And uh, give it some control G. Yeah, we got. The, the, there are a lot of unknowns about this. The only thing I do know is it's not going to be easy. It's not going to go smoothly. And uh, I might need to turn on the purchase of oil again in order to uh, in order to meet demand. Either that or run an additional train down to the. Uh, that's the smarter thing to do. You are producing enough oil. To, uh, to hit max demand on this. True. This wonky-ass flipping train track is ridiculous, but I love it. Yeah. And it's because it's got so much bounce going on at the same time. Uh, anyway, I've been Colonel Failure. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Keep your criticism to yourself. Uh, I'll be back next time with another one. And, uh, and that should be relatively soon. Who's, what have we got going on here? If this is messed up again, I, I can't leave the episode. No, no, no. There's a, there's a train emptying at the border at the moment. Yeah. But I want to finish with a dramatic crossing of the river. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that train's emptying at the border. Should we get out and have a look? Yeah, let's get out and have a look. Yeah, it's emptying at the border. You're fine. You've actually, you've actually got enough queuing place going on there. Also worth noting, we're not going to get any more money for this delivery, obviously, when it's actually delivering something, than we are for this one. Uh, it's just to, because, you know, we've got a queue here. A better queuing solution would be a good idea. Yeah, especially since you're queuing and you shouldn't, you shouldn't actually need to. Have a rethink of your junctions. I might have a rethink of my junctions. But, uh, you know, it, it'll be what it is. Right, get back on the train. We're going to be... No, you've, no, no, you'll be able to go. Will you remember, block signals do your head in. There's no signal on this section at all. You're going to be held waiting, despite the fact you're going a completely different tra way to the train that's on the track there. Well, you know what? Stuff that. You can't put a signal there. For God's sake. Put one in here. There you go. There you are. Look. There you are. See, you've still you've still got plenty of space. Yeah, I bet it doesn't work. Right. I'm Colonel Folio. I'll be back soon. Uh, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and if you can bear to. And uh, I'll uh, I'll catch you next time. Right. Good. Come on. We've got to get across the bridge. I'm not going to do another outro. I've done them already. I've done all of my uh, exit the building stage left. There we go. Finally, we're rolling. And this this is a bit of a manky bit of track overlay going on here. Evidently, should try and keep it on the flat, although that's easier said than done. Uh, right. Come on. Off we jolly well toddle. You know what else? When you turn the UI off, it should turn the border off as well. I know, that's just me. Where can we look? Look over there. Look at all of the derelict flipping business going on here. This is electrified. Ooh. Makes quite the aggressive sound, too. Right, I'll catch up with you soon. Thanks for watching. Cheerio. Flipping it, that was painful. You thought the flipping, uh, what's it, cable cars was painful. Not as painful as that was. My goodness me. Look, I get block signals. I know how they work. 
It doesn't mean that they work in a sensible fashion. It's, I, I get it. I understand how the logic behind, no, you can't enter this section of track. Even though there is nothing that could possibly get in your way, you can't enter that section of track. I get it. Anyway, chain signals, as many of you have been saying, may end up being the solution to this problem. That and relaying all the track half a dozen times and then putting the signals back in again. Yeah, okay, right, well. So, uh, in terms of the status of this series, I'm going to crack on with it for a little while longer. Um, and then, uh, rather than, you know, giving it the boot, I think I'll, I'll reinvent it. So, we'll carry on with this playthrough, but I'll do uh, slightly more focused project episodes rather than me losing my flipping marbles at a piece of... Uh, of, of design choice that has not quite gone according to plan. That's the plan anyway, according or otherwise. So, uh, so I'll catch you, uh, catch you next time then probably. Could happen. So uh, there you are.